Hundreds of people came out this morning to pay their final respects to a Butte businessman and sports legend. MTN's John Amy was at today's funeral for Ron Euland. Ron Euland did not seek attention. But you wouldn't know that judging by the hundreds of people that attended his funeral Friday. Ron Euland was a very understated person who did many, many great things. And you can see it here. The uh, people are lined up down the block. Euland died of a heart attack at age 65 last Saturday at his ranch west of Butte. He was a sports legend in Butte and for the Montana State Bobcats, as well as an enterprising visionary in the Butte business community. Personally, he was always a great friend, always welcome, always knowledgeable. So I'll miss him. A former teammate who played football with Ron Ulan, both at Butte Central and the Montana State Bobcats, came all the way from Seattle to be at the funeral today. Because he said Ulan was not only a great athlete, he was a tremendous leader on and off the field. He was a wonderful, wonderful uh, person, somebody I emulated. And uh, there was a reason he was captain of both his high school team and his college team is because uh, he was a, a tremendous uh, leader and person. Just before his death, Euland was getting ready to start a malt processing plant just west of Butte called Montana Craft Malt. In Butte, John Amy, MTN News. Euland is survived by his wife Sue and their three children and seven grandchildren.